Hello dear brothers and sisters in Christ. I hope that you are all having a very beautiful and a blessed day. Thank you so much for joining me on the channel. If you have been blessed with the opportunity to see this video today, I ask that you subscribe to my channel to join the Happy Christian Family. And also please share with friends and family so that they may also receive the message of the Lord. In today's video is a rapture dream revelation from one of our sister from Kenya. I'm going to read it the same way it was delivered to us. No part has been taken out and nothing has been added to the story. Please watch this video to the end as I proceed. Please keep me anonymous. About 12 years ago, I was around 12 to 13 years old or so. I had a dream that I was ascending into heaven in a beam of light with a close friend. It was almost like a tornado, but I knew I was safe and this was the rapture. It all happened so quickly. It was the most exhilarating feeling. However, when I got to heaven, I was sent back to prepare my dad for what was happening. Like being sent back in time a few hours to make sure my dad was ready. Upon arriving back in my bedroom from where I had been raptured, I ran to my dad and told him. At this point in life I was heavily involved in church and youth. I had always felt a desire to be close to God since I was very very young and it was at this time that I truly blossomed spiritually. I felt I was being called to watch over my dad. He had spent much of his life as an alcoholic and he and my mom fought a lot. I always protected him in some way from the wrath of my mother. Although my dad said he was a believer, but I didn't see it much from him. I told him of this dream about a year ago and asked if he knew if he would go to heaven or not. I often thought of him and my mom since I was living far away. My dad is approaching his mid-seventies, I couldn't stand the thought of never telling him. He told me he had made peace with God and that he knew where he was going when he dies. Here is my second dream. I had this dream about two years ago. The nations of the world were being gathered up in one place to prepare for war. I was in a huge gymnasium-like place with some people I knew. It was very orderly with rows of chairs facing forward. In my mind I knew it wasn't the rapture, but some sort of event preceding it. As I sat in the chair, groups of people were being called forward to give up their cell phones. A tall dark African man was in charge of this. He had a foreign accent and was collecting cell phones. As I approached him, he took me aside and told me that I need to change the way I was living, that I need to be pursuing God like I knew how to. Then I was sent back to my seat. This dream did not have the same happy, exhilarating feeling as the first. It felt almost ominous and had a sense of urgency. At the time, I was not involved in church anymore and wasn't attending regularly at all. I had moved away from home one to two years prior for my husband's new job and had been lazy about finding a new church. I had grown stagnant in many areas spiritually, so I attribute this to that warning I received. Those are my two rapture dreams experience. So thank you for watching this video to the end. Please help us get this message out to the rest of the world by sharing to all your friends and family members. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, 
please do so right away so that you can receive other videos on God's word in the days and weeks ahead. I'm grateful to you and may God continue to bless you till our next meeting.